so perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. The lineup we have suggests it's going to be a 4-5-1 formation, Jim. Well, most teams that use this system, Peter, will work it in a, a way where, yes, they'll have a 4-5-1 shape off the ball and ideally a 4-3-3 shape on it. We often see that... 4-1-4-1 shape too and that has an obvious flexibility about it it's a it's a popular managerial selection because of that it's just extremely flexible with all the numbers i've mentioned so that's got things on the way kiko femenia cabasele hughes ball's gone out of play Kiko Femenia. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Foster deals with it effortlessly. Kiko Femenia. Sa. And it's to Kore. Dini. Cooks through there. Sa. Kapu. Great strength. Too strong for his opponent. Hughes, Kapu, Kapu hits that long, Barnes gets good distance on it, looks to set one up, great leap, no oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed, I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Oh, terrible pass. And Marte. Perez. And Marte. Barnes delivers. And here's Perez. What an adventurous run from a defender. Towering header. Goal! A lovely header, but really it was all about the delivery. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. And it's played forward. And it's the goalkeeper's to claim. Perez. Madison. Dinks one in. 
Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. Madison. He's left his man. Perez. In comes the cross. Madison. Kiko Femania. Sa. Kiko Femania. Kapu. Didi. Leicester are playing with a pleasing width here, especially that front line. Is it working for you? Um, it's not movement for the sake of it, and yes, it is working for me. There's a purpose to, to create space. He's pinged one through here. Goalkeeper's ball. So. Cathcart. Kapu. Cathcart plays it forward. Well played, he saw that coming. Didi. Oh, good interception. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Shoes. Vardy, whose goal-scoring skills have already been evident. And it's Barnes. Watford are still behind as we reach out for half-time. Amati floats one over. Yeah, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Cathcart. Pereira. Perez battles to win it back. Amati. Sonchu. Tielemans. Barnes. Tielemans. He's played him through. Fardy! And in it goes. Two up and threatening to pull clear. Oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. So that's two. And we hit half time. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position. So why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? And we're off again. Well, this half might require them to produce a plan A, B and C. Leveling the score is easier said than done, but that will be the target. Get back on terms and then use that momentum to go again. Cathcart. Kapu. 
Cathcart tries to get it forward quickly. Tielemans. Sonchu. Ndidi. Amati. Perez. Pereira. Capu. Pereira. Capu. Forward it goes. Defending of the desperate variety. Yeah, it looks like a, a change of approach, and it may just freshen things up. And it's Barnes. That's a promising ball. Got a sight of goal here. Header! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Ah, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. So. I think they've got to make a statement now to say to their opposition, we're not giving up without a scrap, to give themselves the belief that this is recoverable. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to go, and he didn't go for the back here. Sa. Leicester look very much like they've got to that time where it's all about closing this one out. Just take the sting out of the opposition. Leicester have somehow to break through, though. Chilwell. Tielemans, Sonchu, Barnes gets into a dangerous position, Cabasele, Ducore, and here's Welbeck. Oh, that is lovely footwork. And it's Hughes. Saar. A chance to play it in. Cuts it out. Pereira. Capu. A buccaneering run from the defender. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. Pereira with the short one. Pereira. A whistle's gone. Now then. And the referee has given a free kick just outside the box. The ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. And it's hoisted clear. Chooses to go back. Oh, sweet feet. And the counter is on. Looking for space out wide. Vardy finds himself offside. Cathcart. Yeah. 
Sunchu. Chilwell. Barnes. Barnes looking up to see who wants it. Played into space out wide. Going for goal! Oh, it looked like 3 0 for sure. He'll be fuming with himself for not converting. He could have killed it off. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after. He's been bundled over. That is a foul. Well, this is worrying. He is not the sort of player who tends to stay down. Dawson. Sal. Sal. Huttling down that right flank. Tielemans has created one goal already. Perez tries lifting it over. That's a corner kick. Watford making another change here. Two changes being made right now. Perez really was well marshaled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. All shows there will be three extra minutes. Madison. Didi Kapu. And that's it. Well, the players certainly gave it everything, but just didn't get the break. Terrific support, terrific effort, but the wrong outcome. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Watford obviously hoping to frustrate and absorb whatever would come their way, but once breached that first time, their game plan was over. So that's it for today. Thank you, Jim. And good afternoon all.